In Nuendo 11, it is now possible to create and monitor your Dolby Atmos or surround sound mix anywhere with headphones using Immerse with VST Ambi Decoder. Many of us don't have access to an Atmos or surround sound studio every day, or are even mixing remotely or on the go with headphones. Instead of an expensive studio speaker array, all you need is your Immerse profile, Nuendo's native VST Ambi Decoder, and your favorite pair of headphones. We'll show you how to create an Atmos mix and monitor your immersive content from anywhere with full spatial accuracy using Immerse. Step 1. Enable Control Room. In Studio Audio Connections, Click on the Control Room tab and enable your Control Room Monitor channel. Right-click to add a phone's channel as your headphone monitoring output and connect your audio device here. Step 2. Set up your Immerse profile. First, please make sure you've downloaded the Immerse application and set up your personalized profile. If you'd like more information, please see our setup guide video. Once complete, you'll have created your very own personalized HRTF, a critical component in accurate spatial listening on headphones, which you can now access directly in Nuendo's Ambi Decoder plugin. On your control room channel, click to open the Ambi Decoder plugin and select Immerse as the HRTF mode. Now you can hear all the spatial details of your Atmos mix accurately, including front, back, and height with your personalized listening profile. Step 3. Set up your Atmos routing. The great thing about Dolby Atmos and monitoring in Ambisonics with Immerse is that either way you can downmix to a variety of channel layouts. Today we will be working in 7.1.4, but you could work in any channel configuration for your mix and monitor with full 360 spatial accuracy with Immerse. In your new Endo project, go to Studio Audio Connections, select the Output tab, Right-click to add your first bus, Third Order Ambisonics, and right-click on Third Order Ambisonics to set it as the main mix. Then, add another bus for 7.1.4 out. Right-click to create a render bus track, set your configuration as 7.1.4, and select 7.1.4 out as your audio outputs. Click on the effects channel on your render bus and insert the renderer for Dolby Atmos plugin. Click on Project ADM Authoring for Dolby Atmos. Select Renderer for Dolby Atmos. Select Add Object. Assign each of your channels under the source track. If you are working with surround sound beds, click on Add Bed and assign your source track here. Step 4. Start mixing. If you are already working in 5.1 or 7.1 audio beds, you're set. The content will automatically be panned correctly. To pan individual mono or stereo sound objects, open the effect channel on each track and enable read automation and write automation. Then double-click on the top right corner to open the VST Multipanner. Play your track and pan and automate your audio sources in all directions. Once your mix is complete, export your ADM file for delivery. And now your workflow is complete! Please click on the link in the description below if you haven't yet downloaded Immerse, and enjoy your premium Atmos and surround sound monitoring experience with Immerse and Nuendo.